Greetings, Glitter Goddesses. It's 4.41 p.m. on Friday, November 29th. It is Black Friday, and we are still going strong here. So I am going to now, um, we're going to put a skin on the outside of the this piece. So um, we're going to start right here. So we know that this piece of chipboard is 9.5 by 4 inches. So all I need to do is cut a piece of cardstock that is nine and a half by four inches. Um, and it should fit right on there, no problem, because the thing is a little bit bigger um, due to being wrapped in cardstock on the sides and all of that. So we're gonna do nine and a half by four. And then once you cut it, just put it on dry and make sure that it does fit and it doesn't hang over any of the sides, which it does. All right, so just stick it down. I did give out the Rota trim, yes. Yes, I did. Um, that went to Priya for her, uh, the Layers of Love album. That was the album that won that one. In hashtag Glitter Party 2019. And you need to claim your prize by 11.55 p.m., on Wednesday, this coming Wednesday, whatever Wednesday that is, the first Wednesday of December. Um, otherwise, you know, it goes back in the prize pool for the next time we do um, giveaways, which will be in February for Scrappy Bowl. And we have a bunch more prizes coming for Scrappy Bowl. We're going to have D stash boxes. Um, we're going to have. Um, all kinds of goodies. We're going to have many, many, many scoreboards. All right, and then I just burnish over this. And I'm supporting it, I'm supporting it with my hand while I burnish it. All right, so next we need to do the side. Now we know that this started off as six and a half by seven. So once again, we're just gonna cut a piece that's the right size. Oops, my microphone's little thingy. Oh, I lost my little gem again. Oh well. Sorry, I had to put my microphone's windscreen back on. All right, so what I'm gonna do with this is I'm just gonna put it sort of rested on the side. So it's resting on my desk. And I'm just gonna take a pencil And I'm going to press it up against the side. And there we go. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this line that I just sketched and I'm going to line it up with my desk and I'm just going to put it in such a way that I know every part of it's going to get cut off and it's going to be straight and then I'm going to go at it with the rotary trimmer okay and then I can hold it up to the side and see, did I get it? 
Is it poking up? It's poking up just a little bit. I'll just cut off a little bit more. Oh no, did Donna not hear her secret word? Donna, your secret word is rolling pin. Your secret word is rolling pin. Okay, so then what I'm going to do is I'm going to see if this will also match the other side. Because if it will also match the other side, then I can just use it as a template, which it does. It matches both sides. So we're just going to cut another piece that is six and a half by seven. And use that up that first one as a template. this off. All right. So. And we're going to keep taping. Tape, 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 tape. This part is really worth doing if you're thinking like, eh, do I need to, can I just go straight in with my pattern paper? Some pattern paper, especially if you're using like a, a paper weight and not a cardstock weight, you know, it's going to show all those ripples and bumps. We don't want those to show. That's what this is for. You know, we're going to cover up all of our sins, our past sins. We're covering our mistakes. We're washing away our sins. They never happened. We were perfect from the jump. All right. That's what we're going to show people that we've, we've always been perfect. We've always been perfect. I forgot to tape the middle, so I'm just going to run some ATG because I don't, I don't really worry about it. Yeah, I'll repeat secret words if you don't remember your secret word and I'll go over all of them at the very end too so there will be one video in the archives that has everyone's secret word oh, look how clean that side is all right now the back it's not seven and a half anymore it's oh it's seven so nine and a half by seven Alrighty, Rooney.
All those overlaps on the left corner. What do you mean these? I need a roll of 3 8 inch tape. Do I have one in my craft room? I do not. Mr. Lifeguard, I don't have 3 8 inch tape or... Oh, wait. Half inch. Half inch. Are we out of half inch? Donna, what worries you about the corner? Are you mean covering it up or, or doing it? Oh, you mean those guys? Th these guys? If we're out of half inch, then we're out of half inch, but I do need three eighths inch and quarter inch. We're not gonna uh, carry half inch anymore and I'm gonna stop using it as soon as we I use up the last of the rolls. So, cause I think three eighths is just fine. Half inch. Cool. Is this the last roll? Mm, yes. <laughs> do you know if this is the last roll? I, I know if it's the last roll, but do they know it's the last roll? Wait, I told them we're not doing half inch anymore. Right. Right. So you're using it though? I'm using it until it's used up. Oh, well then yes, you have more. Okay. I'm just confused. All right. Got to get the bottom, which is nine and a half by six and a half. And then We'll call this box done.
Now, doing really well. Okay, so, ta-da! All right, we've got the outside done. So, now we have to do the inside. And the inside's a little trickier because everything is smaller, all right? Everything is smaller because of the layers of paper, because of chipboard shifting around. So everything is just, everything is smaller. Oh no, Cindy, you, that's not a good state of affairs. All right, so. First things first. In the front, you know, we know that that piece of chipboard that it's on is nine and a half by four, right? Except, you know, we've lost, we've lost space. So I'm going to cut nine and three eighths by three and seven eighths and see if that'll slide right in. No, it does not. Yeah, it does. All right, so nine and three eighths by three and seven eighths. I don't know why I put my tape away. Julie, I use and sell in our shop Miracle Tape. Right now we have a Miracle Tape bundle, which is, um, I think it's 25 bucks. And it's uh, four rolls of the three eighths and two rolls of the quarter inch. So it's basically, it's the price of four rolls of three eighths, but you're getting the two quarter inch free. Um, I have been using Miracle Tape since 2013, at least. I like it just as good as score, ta score tape, except for the size that's 1 8. I don't think the Miracle Tape is that great in 1 8. But in all the other sizes, I've been using it for, like I said, since 2013, and I haven't had any problems with it. Now, you'll notice that Miracle Tape rolls and Score Tape rolls are about the same price, but Miracle Tape rolls are twice as long. So you get twice as much tape. So it's a really big savings. Um, all right, so I've got that down. So now I've just got to jam my try and get my hand in there get everything burnished okay but see even on the inside what a difference it makes all right Next piece is one I'm gonna do here. So the distance I believe is one and seven eighths. Yeah. Now, do you guys 
on yours. You know, we're gonna try We'll do one seven eighths by nine and three eighths. Without putting any tape on it, I'm gonna drop it in and see if it'll fit. Okay, so it's a little too it's a little too wide, so I need to cut it instead of one and seven eighths, I'm gonna do one and three quarters. I'm actually going to just cut off a sixteenth of an inch and see if that's enough. Uh, okay, yes. So I'm going to hook it back out. And then we'll... Um, the Black Friday sale bundle is going to go um, through the weekend through Cyber Monday. Um, but when you get up Tuesday morning, it'll probably be gone. Now, if we, um, sell out, which I don't know how likely that is. Maybe Mr. Lifeguard can let me know. Um, I guess we could do a pre-order if people wanted to. If we run out before the bundle is, uh, before the, before the sale ends, um, I'll, I'll consider doing a pre-order. They can be a little, um, slow to ship to me though, just so you know. So, um, it might take a while if we do pre-orders, it'd be a few weeks before they came back in. So if we do a pre-order, I'll put a note. All right, so now we've got that in, pressed into the bottom. Okay, so that ended up being, what was it? One and one sixteenth less than one and seven eighths. So that's a pretty good guess that the side is gonna be that size as well. So what we're going to do is I'm going to put this in and then I'm going to um going to take my pencil and just mark the side. And then I'm going to cut this like an eighth of an inch off. Okay. So I'm not gonna, oops, I'm going to line the line up with the edge of my, Let's see. I cut the wrong side cause I'm dumb. Look, All right, one and 13 sixteenths. All right, so then this will fit now down in there. So we, we'll, get, we'll do it. Huh. All right, let me just make sure I put tape on the right side. And let's see if this fits both sides. It does, so I'm gonna take, uh, Just going to use it as a template to cut the other one so I can do them both. All right.
so and again this part is not the most fun or glamorous or whatever it can be a little tedious but this is what gives you that polished look so it's worth doing it's going to keep stuff that goes in and out of the pockets from catching Uh, yeah, Julie, I don't know that it would last that long, um, but it's, we will do a pre-order. So, um, if we do run out, I will do a pre-order and we'll order some to fulfill for, I'll order some miracle tape from Viva Las Vegas stamps. That's who makes it. Uh Oh, all right. Well, we'll probably end up doing a pre-order. So when we're out of tape bundles, we'll switch it to a pre-order so that you can still get the deal, even though we ran out of tape. It's funny because we put, we took, we, t <laughs> we tried, we tried. You never know how much you're going to need. So it's all good. Oh, are they both? They're, they're the wrong. Oh, good. They're both headed the same direction. Yeah, that's, that's, we'll, we'll still have it on the first. Okay, so um, what I'm going to do now, because I'm lazy and I don't want to cut a new piece, is I'm going to glue this to another piece, cut it, and then put tape on the other side. <laughs> See? So now the tape is not sticking out anymore. At some point, they're probably going to come up here and tell me that dinner, Thanksgiving dinner is ready because we're doing Thanksgiving today. So um, I'll have to go at that point, but we'll do more of this project. I won't let it. We, we will finish it. Because I think it's looking good. And it'll look really cute once it has Christmas paper on it. Okay, so this one's five inches, nine and a half by five inches. So we're going to cut nine and, uh, nine and three eighths by four and seven eighths. Yep, there we go. Oh, yes, I will get the last prize before I go, for sure. The Christmas paper is really nice. There's some really, really beautiful prints in it. And remember, it's 50% off right now. Um, we So far, we've had a Rototrim... A year's membership to the archives. A We Are Memory Keepers frame punch. 
the Creative Grid six and a half by 12 and a half ruler with the rotary trimmer that I use and a Misty. And the prize, the last prize that we have left um, still to come is the uh, Canon Selfie, Canon Selfie printer. And the Christmas paper is Country Christmas by Simple Stories. And I have it linked, the digital collection, I have it linked below because Simple Stories is doing 50% off digital for Black Friday. So you can get the paper collection that I'm gonna use to decorate for half price. And Mr. Lifeguard has also posted it. All right, so just to give you an idea of the difference, I mean, just look at how it looks just covered in cardstock on the inside. So you do want to take the time to cover it with cardstock on the inside as well because it's just a huge, huge difference. Okay, so So next piece is I'm going to cut uh, two inches because it was two and an eighth before and okay so it's still two and an eighth is still too small or, or two just two is too small so I'm going to do one and fifteen sixteenths. <laughs> Yep, that's what I need. Now this one is a bit bigger, so I probably could have kept my original size, but oh well. These are, they ended up being one and 15 sixteenths. But just, just remember that the measurements I'm giving you for these, you know, it might, it might vary in your project because it's all gonna depend on how your box came together and how thick your cardstock is, stuff like that. All right, just to save some time, I'm going to use ATG. Um, I do not recommend this for yours. Of course, you want to use um, Miracle Tape, Score Tape, something strong. But I just want to get this done a little bit more quickly. So I'm just going to do the ATG.
All right. Once I get the sides done, it's really going to go a lot faster. But I think all we're going to be able... I hear my sister, I think, plating Thanksgiving dinner. So I'm going to have to go very shortly. But I want to at least get this done. So at least the box is done. All right. So we've got all the sides done. And now we have to, what are we going to do? Um, do the bottoms, then do the last two sides. Another sheet of paper. Nine and three eighths. And then what are, what are you? Cause I don't know what the risers. Okay, four and a quarter or three and three quarters. Okay. So instead of three and three quarters. Let's do three and five eighths. Yep, that's fine. So nine and three eighths by three and five eighths. Gonna slide it in. And burnish it. All right, so now that's there. And then the back is uh, four and five eighths. See how they're all crazy? All right, so. <laughs> <laughs> so instead of four and five eighths, we'll just do four and a half. All right, there we go. That'll clean that up. And again, I'm using the ATG to be fast. I don't recommend you use the ATG. I recommend that you take the time to Use your miracle tape, really get it nice. I know, Judy, we are going long. All right, so now we just need this bottom piece, which we know is one and what was it? One in like 15 sixteenths, right? Okay.
I don't see all my gray, all my gray hair. All right, clean, clean, clean. Okay, so this is three and, I don't know, three and five eighths. So let's try three and a half. And actually, this looks like it might be big enough that I can just drop it in the bottom. Yeah. So I'm gonna just drop it in the bottom. I'm glad, Julie. I know a lot of people find that those Fiskars trimmers uh, frustrating, but you can get a lot better results with just a few trips, tricks. Okay, so we've got to get this piece and this piece. So this one we're going to do, let's just do three and a half. So it's nine yeah nine and three eighths by three and a half and then we just tuck it see if it works which it does Yes, this is a very sturdy box. All the layers of paper are reinforcing each other. We're getting rid of areas where you can catch things. Last piece, and then our box is all clad. Five and seven eighths, so five and three quarters. Three, nine and three eighths by five and three quarters. Okay, I don't know what the heck that was. Uh, must be four and three quarters. Yep, <laughs> it's four and three quarters. <laughs> it smells like Thanksgiving in my office. The food smells have made their way all the way up here. So. Mr. Lifeguard's office is on the same floor as the kitchen, so I imagine it's been worse for him for a while. <gasps> Ta-da! Okay, so. We did it! We made it! We made it, we made it. We made it to the end of the box. The box is totally constructed. Looky there. So, we have everything we need 
to uh, have our cool, super adorable box. But here's the kicker. So when we put something in it, okay, it sticks out about the same amount from every box. All right, so what's gonna happen is all our pieces are the same height. All right, so they're gonna, they're gonna stay all the way up. They're gonna go in a slant as well. Our pieces are gonna go in a slant. All right, so that's, so that's, that's my alarm to tell me I really need to shut up. Okay, that's, that was, <laughs> Um, that was, <laughs> that's my alarm that it's like really cut it off. You know, <laughs> so if you're, if you're still doing the show, you need to stop doing the show. So we made it, we made it before that alarm. All right. So great news. So what we're going to do is I'll work on this again. Don't worry. We still have to do the inserts. I've designed inserts for it. We still have to do the closure. I've got a closure for it. So there's lots left to do. I don't know when exactly we'll do it, but I will finish this before the end of the year. We'll get it done before Christmas. We'll probably do sneaky shows. That's probably the only way we're gonna have time um, because I wanna get split decision done before the end of the year as well. So, all right, so. Um, so thank you all so much for watching everyone who joined me. Be sure to check the links in this video's description for all of the uh, everything because there's the links to our sale. There's links to Simple Stories' sale. Um, there's all kinds of there's all kinds of links. Um, so the cardstock that I've been using has been the fresh malt. That's linked below as well. I'm also going to be using the bark for a dark brown accent. If you have any of that, I used, that's the one that I used in the, um, <sighs> Mr. Lifeguard better watch out. He's going to get banned for spamming. Um, so uh, I also use, I'm going to be using the bark in this book as well. So that's still to come. Um, and you need a lot of the fresh malt. You need a lot of the fresh malt, everyone, because you need, or whatever you're going to cover your box with, because you need a lot to cover the box as well as um, all the folders are going to be made out of it as well. All right. So I am going to do a, um, I'm going to cut the recording here for YouTube and then I'll do a quick prize recording for the last prize of the night and I'll read all the prizes that everyone won as well. But I hope you all had a happy Thanksgiving and a wonderful um, holiday season coming up. And I will see you on Thursday at 2 p.m. Eastern USA time for our regular show. Thanks so much. Bye now.